Okay, brother, that's what we got. So, this is all the uh, ECM harness that's over here underneath the seat. Go down through here, up on top of the engine, run the transmission and the engine. But it's got to go into this box, which is for the electronic gas pedal. And then this goes over to the pedal. That'll go up over. This is the uh, check engine light and the diagnostic connector. And then that ties into this box here. Goes up and goes into what we call a BIM module right here. So I can read all the data from my OEM computer under the seat. Read all the speed sensors for the transmission, uh, water temperature, oil temperature, RPM, check into light, everything. Run right through that. And then that feeds into this box here, which I got a bunch of wires still got to go into it, like TAC, uh, cruise, uh, brake lights, there's a couple other things that go into that. The fuse box here, that goes to the standalone harness that you and I worked on. Uh, obviously, this is a, one of these is key on, uh, engine off. The other one is a key on, uh, key on engine, uh, power on. Power hot, one's hot all the time. I'll spit it out here in a minute. Uh, so that's with the key on to the fuse box. The other one is uh, full time battery power uh, to the fuse box. And then I got all these little giddy giddy wires here. Then I got to run these. these got speedometers. Goes into my into this board up here. Um, there's a few other things in here. Tack. Uh, some stuff I probably won't use right away. There's cruise control. Um, uh, that's what that is. Cruise. We're running out of wires, dude. This is a good thing. Uh, another cruise control. One's got to go to the brake switch to kill the cruise. Um, there's all kind of shit. Signal to start a solenoid. Uh, I don't know where the fuck that's going to go. I guess that's got to go up there in that box. I'm not sure yet. I got to figure that one out. So, anyway, we're getting closer. I'm done. I think it turned out pretty good. So, where's my fuck up? So, that right there, I cut that hole too big. So, I just made this plate, but I cut, was, couldn't put the plate on the back side because this bushing was, this grommet wasn't uh, thick enough. But it worked. Make a carpet on it, it'll be covered up. What I'll probably do is make a box to go over this, just to, uh, some sort of take it to herb and probably bend it like an aluminum box to go around it and just snap over the top of like a, just to clean it up. It doesn't look bad though. I mean, I think it'll, nobody else gonna have one like this, buddy.